house fire at 2500 Glen Lee. Um, coming in the front door, the fire originated in the kitchen. Um, tenant advised that she had something on the stove cooking. She went out to walk the dog. And when she comes back, this is what happened. <laughs> so between the fire and the fire department, <laughs> welcome to my mess. Uh, so it was involving us having to take in the whole ceiling and a uh, half part of, partial of the wall out in um, the kitchen. Um, so this is actually a four bedroom unit with one and a half bath. And um, so I'm going down the hall. So the, this is the first bedroom that I think this ceiling in this bedroom is gonna have to be taken out. So that's um, something that we will have to come back and revisit. And then we'll, down here, this is the hallway full bath, which you see that the kitchen, I mean that the ceiling has already been taken out in this room, in this bathroom. So while I'm at it, I might as well just rip everything out of this bathroom and just start anew. And then this was, this is the master bedroom, which the fire department came in and pulled insulation down and pulled this, cut a hole in the ceiling. Well, they cut a hole in the roof. So all that had to be replaced with and took all the the ceiling out in here. Um, half of the ceiling, well, we took the whole ceiling out, but half of the insulation was still some good in this room here. And then this is the half bath here, which I think the ceiling is still intact, but got a lot of smoke damage. And um, then this is bedroom number three which is on the opposite side of the house where the kitchen was, that we um, just basically a lot of smoke damage in this room here. Here. And this is bedroom number four, which is on the opposite side of the kitchen where everything took place. And um, that's what we got there. So that is going to be the job I'm going to be looking at, trying to basically put this house back together again. Thank you for going on the tour.